I kind of, I kind of don't want to get my hand near this in case it gets bitten off. Now we have got for you something brand new today on QVC. How exotic is this? Five zero two two nine seven. The carnivorous pot plant collection for fourteen ninety eight. Tell us more. So these are insect eating plants. So the summer's coming up. Obviously, f flies and yes. small insects are yeah. always in the homes as they get warmer. Yeah. Grow some Venus fly traps and Saracenia pitcher plant, and you know, no more flies. You know, if so I can these are show house you, you keep these indoors. Yep, indoors yeah, okay. on a on a windowsill, light windowsill, not too much sun. Yeah, just need a bit of moisture, so stand them in a tray of pebbles and mist them each day. But they're really easy and. You can see this. I've got to just let you know there are cues on the phone, so I want you to use cue cut or the website. Secondly, just be really clear what are they different varieties we're getting? Yep, so what you will receive are these slightly smaller pots here. So you'll yeah. receive a Venus flytrap. Yes. And a pitcher plant. Great. In so these nine each. centimeter pots. Okay. Um, I've just got these slightly larger ones to show you on. what the plants do. Yeah. And what's this is this? a fly that I trapped earlier. Can you see the fly, home? Yeah. Let's just make sure a we can see the fly. fly. So that's fine. So no flies are going to be harmed <laughs> in the making of this show. And I'm going to see if I can show you how a fly would be trapped in this one. So this goes in, and then the small. Oh my goodness! You see, and oh. the small hairs on the side. The fly needs to touch at least two or three hairs, and so it knows that it's a fly, not a water drop. And then it closes up, and then the plant starts to digest it. The enzymes there. If you take there, that out, will you to... hurt the plant? If you were to pull it out, would you hurt the plant? And we can tease that out gently okay, later, okay. but okay. it's not going to be able to digest the plastic. Right. But no, 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 but what I mean is to show us again, in case anyone <laughs> yeah, missed it. Well, I have. Some you got, more. Oh, he's got more. Got He's got some more, more so fake flies. I'm going to get these. We'll try I this cannot one. stand. And because I've got a, 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 I live in a Victorian house, <laughs> so the ceilings are really high, mm. and I can never actually get them. Okay. I can spend hours chasing them around with a towel, trying to sort of fan them out again. <laughs> it doesn't work. Look at that. Absolutely. So, so when you're sat having a wonderful lunch with your family or friends or watching telly, you haven't got that annoying. Mm. Mm. So that's the Venus flytrap, which I'm sort. Sure, everyone's heard of, but not necessarily tried and to kids grow. Kids will love that, it, won't yeah, they? Yeah, absolutely. Kids love that. And as I say, they're really easy to grow. People don't need to panic. They just need a moist, moist tray of pebbles underneath right. and just mist them about every couple of days. And you get instructions. Really easy, full instructions. Right. So that is the Venus flytrap. This is fewer than 250 of these. So busy, don't miss out. This is the pitcher plant, and this works in a slightly different way. Right. If you can see the tubes here. Yeah. They've kind of got. They're, they're really colourful at first. And they've got a sweet nectar inside, and they're really slippery. So, so the, the fly insect goes in, yeah, and then kind of slides down, and then goes straight to the bottom. It then can't get back up, yeah, and then starts to be digested. So that's how that one. So sorry, eats flies, its you're going to come to a sticky end. <laughs> Fourteen ninety-eight. Now that two hundred, fewer than two hundred remaining. Uh, five zero two two nine seven. Many thanks to Michael Perry. I'm going to be ordering those. Thank you, Michael. See you soon. Uh, Fourteen ninety-eight.